I think that we all do heroic things, but hero is not a noun, it's a verb. I think that the power is the principle. The principle of moving forward, as though you have the confidence to move forward, eventually gives you confidence when you look back and see what you've done. I always think part of success is being able to replicate results, taking what is interesting or viable about yourself as a professional person and seeing if you bring it into different situations with similar results. Do I want to be a hero to my son? No. I would like to be a very real human being. That's hard enough. I want to give myself the freedom not to have to be projecting my whole life ahead. I grew up with a lot of people whose whole prime mover was dad rage. I never really had it, it always seemed so empty. It always seemed to be masking something else, which was really their own lack of initiative. All I want, and I think all any parent with a semblance of a moral psychology wants, is for my kid to have his own experience, uninhibited. It's interesting when you're old enough to take a new objective approach looking at your parents frame them in a way where you are actually taking yourself out of the equation and just look at the things that are true about their life in movies people seem to be more emotional than they would ever be if that situation was actually happening to them it's hard to get out of the barrel it's slippery around the edges and people are happy to see you fall back in I think you end up doing the stuff you were supposed to do at the time you were supposed to do it. There are some parents who have really done it right and told their kid, you know, we have this dough, none of this is for you. You have to get your own. Job one is to get out of that cave. A lot of people do get out but don't change. I'm not afraid of total failure because I don't think that will happen. I'm not afraid of success because that beats the hell out of failure. People never change because they are under threat or under duress. Never. They change because they see something that makes their life seem valuable enough to start moving toward a life worth living. Discipline for me is about respect. It's not even about self-respect. It's about respect for life and all it offers. Nothing will serve you better than a strong work ethic. Nothing. Everybody wants a happy ending. Right? But it doesn't always roll that way. Remember that just because you hit bottom doesn't mean you have to stay there. People rise out of the ashes because at some point, they are invested with a belief in the possibility of triumph over seemingly impossible odds.